Hey, what's going on? This is EJ Uno, and I'm back again with a review and talking about the iOS 14 beta. It's out publicly. If you got an Apple iPad um, um, laptop made by Apple, and um, it's ready to download. So we're going to be taking a good look at that after I get done downloading it. I am a public beta tester so I got this this is not my main driver phone so I very stressed that do not use this on your your main driver of your phone because it might be some bugs that they need to fix and it so you're gonna get plenty of updates to fix those bugs but you know your phone could be acting up so do it on something else that you don't use that much that is iOS so I so if you're very familiar with downloading this beta all you do is, um, if, and if you're not, you just go on to the Apple Store and follow the directions. And then once it's ready to download, all you do is you go into the settings, go to general, check for updates, and there it is. Let me zoom in on that. Um, I don't know if you, uh, let me, wow. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me put the torch thing. Okay, that's not good right there either. Okay, so I am back right now, and the uh, update is done. It is, as you can see, it is on iOS 14. Your software is up to date. Um, to tell you the truth, the unlock button seems to be working like pretty fast. It's uh, I, I, for some reason, I think it improved itself a little bit. So if you swipe to the side right there, you know, you got your tag. They changed it up a little bit. So as you see right there, you got your date, um, calendar, um, how to. This is a couple stuff of your apps and all that stuff right there. You're going to keep them going to the other side. And you're surrounded. You're um, surrounded. <laughs> You end up where all your apps are all in category right there. These are all my apps that are in category. It looks pretty cool though. I like it. And um Okay, so you just the settings. Okay. Same seem to move pretty smoothly. Uh let's go to let's see. So with the beta it's it's pretty cool, pretty nice. Okay, so I heard, so I saw that they said that you can, some tricks that you can do. Let me see if I swipe down. Let me um get rid of some of my stuff on here. Okay, so let's say, um, I know they say if you want to just hold your thumb and you can, let me see, you can, how do you move, how do you make a widget come over? So, okay, so I guess you just do that. So, what happened? Okay, so that's pretty cool right there. So, you just add the widget into there, the today's date right there. And then, let me see, swipe up, turn out the Bluetooth right there. Um, let me see if they add anything new. No, that's good right there. See some new, more new stuff that probably could be on here. Just the only thing I'm seeing is this right here where you sw they they change the layout over there. Swipe to the side. There's your app drawer basically right there. Um, oh, let's do the video and picture. Let's see how that works. So uh, got that, and then let's uh. I guess I'll just play him, and then let's see how this. Just... better. The Samsung Galaxy. Okay. The A21 or the Samsung Galaxy A51. Well, in this video, we're gonna find out. 
Now, I could have swore I thought they said it was picture in picture, but I guess you got to go in there and find it yourself. So let's go to the settings and see what new things they have on the settings. Okay, so let me know about the Wi Fi home screen. Show in app library. Let's see what that's it. App library only. So I guess when you do that. Hmm. Okay. Oh, notification badge. Okay. So turn that on. Add to home screen. App on. So, that's a new little thing that came up with the home screen. Um, let me see. Control center. I guess this is. Let me turn this all this stuff on right there. Let's see how the dark mode looks on there. Dork mode. Okay. Okay, this app. Okay, so anyway, so I think that's pretty much what I see different about it. I guess it just did like a couple little steps, <laughs> but um, I mean, it's cool. It's all right. Um, yeah, it's cool. Um, it's different. I guess it, you know, it it put all your stuff in order, like put your games with the other your entertainment stuff, with the um, creative stuff. Social media. Okay, I see what you're saying. To me, it kind of looks like a little bit of an Apple type, not Apple, a Windows type of theme to me, but that, that's just me saying that. It looks less like, it don't look, it look like Windows if everybody remembers how Windows used to look. That's what it looks like. But anyway, <laughs> that's just my thoughts on it. Um, the beta is pretty smooth, but I'm pretty sure they, this is only the second one, so I'm pretty sure they're going to have a third and fourth one before the final one. So, I guess we'll just stay tuned. I'll keep you up to date with new beta. Um, this is, is EJ You Know. And stay tuned for um, more vlogs or more reviews or whatever it is. <laughs> Catch you then.